Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Let's Play Neverwinter Nights. In our last episode, we had brought Dester to justice, and we had moved on to Port Last, and after some lengthy dialogue between myself and Arabeth... Yeah, I get it. After some lengthy dialogue between myself and Arabeth, we had determined that we need to search around for some clues as to the whereabouts of this cult. So, let's get on that. Now, Aaron Gen said a good place to start looking was the... the caves. You best be careful mm, treading the road around the these parts. North it's side a dangerous of town. place these days. Listen, to old Gerald. Your Gerald? Your son mentioned you. He did, did he? He's a fine lad, he is. I expect then that you're some manner of adventurer that he thought could help us, eh? What kind of help do you need? Well now, that's a bit of a tale. I'm surprised the boy didn't fill you in. The hills in this area are home to creatures of all sorts. Bugbears, goblins, and the like. Normally they don't trouble us much since Luskin stopped patrolling the area, mind you. They've become plenty brave. For weeks now, they've been attacking anyone passing through these parts, attacking the farm a few times too. That's when they meet off with my wife. I figure it's all that Durgiab's doing. Damn ogre, we'll get what's coming to him one way, one way or another, I swear it. What's that about your wife? Leah is her name. She was taken from the farm one evening when the boy and I were out scouting the hills. Nothing we could have done about it. Them creatures have never shown any interest in taking taking folk before. I'm not even sure why they should start now. Durgi has behind it for sure, though. I can only pray that she's alright yet. I'll get her back somehow, and then that ogre will pay for all the grief he's caused me. Perhaps I could help. Maybe you could at that. I can reward you if that's what you're keen for. I'll warn you, though, you wouldn't be the first adventurer to head into the hills. There have been other adventurers. Aye, a few have passed this way and headed into the hills to check out the creatures for themselves. None have returned, I'm afraid to say. What kind of reward are we talking? To be honest, I haven't much left for my adventuring days. I'd be happy to offer what gold I have, though, to have some proof of what happened to my wife. Or, better yet, to have her returned. I'd also offer gold for Dirk Yab's head to know for sure that he won't be pestering anyone else in these parts. I know it's not much. Chances are Dirk Yab will have plenty to loot himself. I'll look into it as soon as I can. I'd be grateful for it. Find my wife or bring me proof of what's happened to her and bring me Dirk Yab's head if you can. Either would be a great service. Alright, so it looks like we're looking for some kind of fat ogre named Durgiab who made off with this guy's wife for who knows what. Chances are it's probably not good. I think Durgiab's after some forcey fun time, if you know what I mean. Uh-oh. Got a whole bunch of goblins over here. Bloody goblins. Well, that was pathetic, but they're goblins, so what can you expect? Garbage. An adventurine is hardly garbage. Hmm. Oh. Wow, that was close. Do your thing, Gara. 
Come on. Move your stupid pixie body. It'd be nice if to get some EXP for the trap she disables, but oh well. I love crap. Die. There we go. down this stupid shaman. <laughs> How does a stupid pixie always manage to be the only one who gets hit? You would, you would think that they would focus on the bigger threats like Grimnaw. Then again, I don't think Grimnog is likely tender to get that team. What's his AC? 25? Holy crap. <laughs> and what about Agara? She's probably going to DC like 5. 50. Alright. Enough screwing around. Let's see. Got a fire agate. I really don't care if that's how you pronounce it. <clears throat> what the hell? Where are all my... S okay, my spells have miraculously disappeared from my hot bar. Give me a second. Well, that was dumb of me. Yeah, I guess I... It would be normal for them not to show while I'm possessing my familiar. I'm a dope. Uh oh, a dire wolf. Winter is coming. Didn't I already tell you to stop trying to help? Is there something you need? Running low in potions here. decided to start another character in Neverwinter Nights in my off time and I've been playing a bard who is going to become a red dragon disciple and it's actually pretty fun but bards are so freaking weak at the beginning of the game. 
but she is getting better. Her bard song is really powerful considering how many times she gets to use it per day. Feel the chill touch of the grave! <laughs> I also took Curse Song, which is nice. Looks like there's a door here that I didn't quite see before. Uh oh. Should probably clear the area before trying to go into a new one. And I've caused an incident. I'm gonna use a blessed potion. I never use these stupid things, so. Oh, you stupid little... See, I got... I wish there was a way to get the girl to stop fighting as long as she's doing any good. There's probably an option in her tactics. I'll have to check that out. think so. to see. Death comes for us all. Let's see. That's now uh, Goblin Chief. Need Vampire to touch him if I can get a good lock on him. There we go. Nice work. Uh oh. Didn't mean to do that either. Stop hitting me, little shit. Quite a bit of damage with that one. Death comes for us all. Hmm. That wasn't as difficult as it should have been. Not a very good chief now, are ya? Can't rest. Let me teleport back to town because I need a Gara. And the price of the Stone of Recall has gone up to 150 gold rather than just 50, so... Better not to go back too often. I need you to stay closer to me. It doesn't seem like there's a way to get her to stop attacking. So, just have to be careful.
Ooh, a plus one crossbow. I think that's what I have right now. Um, yeah. Oh. There's nothing in my bag of holding right now, so I might as well just stuff that in there so I don't get any excess weight. A bugbear prisoner. This should be interesting. No hurt me, please. Help, me as prisoner here, you release me, yeah? Or is you working with Orc and Goblin? Me just want leaving, not like prisons. Help me, please help. Is this an ambush? I'll not trust you. Me got no weapons, me got no other bugbears. No one is here, you see, me just wants not being prisoner. Gets back to war with Orcs and Goblins. How do I know you're actually a prisoner, that this isn't some ruse? He's basically just saying what he just said before. You tell me some stuff and maybe I'll let you go. Uh, okay. Me not know as much about but prison bars, but we try to answer all questions. We want out of prison, yeah? Why are you a prisoner here? What's this war about? We is fighting with orcs and goblins, gets beaten and taken prisoner. Everyone wants pleasing masters who needs beating other forces to make strength. I don't understand what you mean by making strength. If we bugbear is beating orc and goblin, the master is happy with us. Take, with, take us for his army, and we'd be most powerful. Army? What do you mean? Me not lying when we say, me not know. Proud warriors get taken by master, but we not know where they is go, they is go or why. Can you tell me anything about these caves? Meekin tells you about their caves is home to orcs, goblins, and us bugbears. We fight so much, not safe in caves for you outsider. What can you tell me of the orcs and goblins? Orcs and goblins is everywhere. We bugbears strong. We fight tough, but we never makes advance for long. Too many foes for us. Do they have leaders to their tribes? Orc chieftain and goblin chieftain in caves. If killed is they, tribes would falls apart. We not know what doing without chieftain. We bugbears got chieftain too, but we prisoner so long not knows where. I'll kill you now, monster. Me run, me run! Eh, he's not hostile, so doesn't look like a good, I'll get to attack him. I just wanted to see the reaction on his face. I think Grimna is giving me his nod of approval. I think I've been down here. No, I have not. A bunch of goblins and orcs fighting with each other. I thought they were on the same side. Strange. Pick a the goblin because uh, he's less of a threat. Agara, what part of state close to me don't you understand? Get over here, you dumb little crap. Hmm. Managed to kill... Well, was that a troll or an orc? No, that was definitely a, an orc. Trolls look a lot different than that. Locks a crate. It'd be nice if there was some sort of graphical, you know, indication that it's locked rather than me just having to go over there and activate it first. I mean, I know I can just go to the radio menu and check, but where's the fun in that? How the hell is a serious potion garbage? Jeez. Hmm. 
Hmm. Five hit dice or less. Um, I'm pretty sure orcs have more than five hit dice, but what the hell? I never used this damn spell. Let's see if I can use it on him. Oh wow, it did work. That's surprising. I guess it's not a completely useless spell, though it is not that great. Anything with a limit on hit dice isn't that great in my opinion. If you want something that'll last for a while. Ugh. Come do your thing. Uh oh. Stupid pixie, get back here and finish picking the lock. You're not even supposed to be fighting in the first place. You know what, I'll just possess you and force you to do it. How do you like that? You are not a warrior. You're a... Like, you're like a six inch tall midget. Is that all you orcs have is ale? Drunk bastards. Door here. Hmm. Quiet, guy. I don't want to keep hearing your pixie gibber. Who's fighting what? How the hell did he... Never mind, I don't care. Get the hell back here! Why are you running off that far away? Ugh, the AI is terrible. <laughs> Probably the only thing that Neverwinter Nights 2 has going for it, considering the horrible camera. I really should play that game again. I know the camera angle isn't really a great reason not to play the game, but I just could not play that game because the camera controls were just so awful. Man, I have a lot of scrolls. there isn't anything over here. Yeah, that's just the entrance back to that room we were just in. So let's see what's over this way. More orcs. Your Nobody saw that coming, right? My home. Oh shit, there's a trap right behind you. I didn't even notice. Spellcasting. Not going to help you at all. Oh, I think I know what's here. Uh, um. Yeah, you're going to unlock that and you're going to like.
Hmm. Oh, Minotaurs. That's what I was afraid of. Challenge rating easy. They don't look too easy. I suppose it's too much to hope that they might have 5 HD or less. Yeah. That was one hell of a crossbow shot. Crossbow shot. Sake. Ah, jeez. Oh, never mind then. Nothing great over here. And this seems to be a dead end, so... Where the hell did they come from? I love it when they just appear out of nowhere, don't you? What do you say, Agara? Trapped? No? Better not be. For your pixie butt's sake. Uh-oh. Seems we've found the orc chieftain. Um, I might want to get out of the corner. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. I'm getting stuck. Wow, it actually worked. That's surprising. Wow. Nice, that gives me a chance to coup de grab them. Let me see if I can scare away this other one. Yep, there we go. And now while he's running scurred, I'll attack him and grim knock and hopefully finish off the stupid chief. Even though she's just not even remotely injured. The silent lord One more hit to you. Until this guy's down. Assuming I ever hit the guy, please. Um, yeah, one damage isn't gonna cut it, pal. You wanna give me some more? Damn it. Come on, give me one good one. There we go. Now, let me administer some healing to Grimna, assuming I can. Oh, you son of a... That almost went sour. How the hell did a Gara die? Dumb little crap. Hmm. Well, I'm not giving up that easily. Let's finish this. Ogre fucker. That's your name from now on, Ogre fucker. Ooh, level up. 
so, another level of Pale Master. Taking the recommended skills again. What is it giving me, by the way? Why the hell would I need Persuade him? Oh. I suppose it's not all that bad. Still, I'm not really understanding the skill distribution here. It keeps putting it into random skills. That plus vigor. The Pale Master gains plus three hit points per level. That's nice. Let's see what it recommends. Toughness. That might actually be good considering you would start stacking on the next level with Deathless Vigor. How much does toughness give per level? Excuse tough. One bonus hit point. So in total I would get four extra hit points per level. That sounds pretty nice. I don't really see anything else here that I want right away, so yeah, we'll go with toughness. So plus 18 hit points this level, that's really nice. Some unidentified armor, plus one AC. Let's throw that in our bag of holding, along with the two-bladed sword. Alright, that went better than expected, but oh no, what's back here? Ah. You stay away. This ghoul is drunk off his ass. Hey, we can't open it. Let's bash it. Bash the hell out of it. And look at that. We've got an ogre. We must protect King Treasure. That's an odd name for a king to have. King Treasure, huh? He must be one wealthy ass king. I'm not really gonna do anything special here, I'll just shoot him to death. He's not particularly powerful. And besides, Grimnock keeps knocking him on his ass. Imagine what it takes for a dwarf to knock an ogre on his ass. Grimnock, you are one badass son of a bitch, you know that? All right, Agar, get your ass down here and do a trap tech. trap check. Pixies are supposed to be really fast, and yet she's always the one pulling up the pulling up the ass of our caboose. Yeah, that didn't really make any sense. Forget I said that. Where are you reaching? The lock is there. So thieves tools plus six, that's pretty good. Some gems. Some quarter staff. What's this? Vampiric regeneration plus one. Uh, protection from alignment casts and bonus plus that's not bad but I mean really for a staff if you're a caster you want it to be able to cast certain spells that you generally don't have many casts of to begin with alright well that seems to be about it for this episode. Join me next time where I'll continue raiding these caves, slaughtering these defenseless orcs. See you guys next time.